Okay, that was pretty cool. Yoo-hoo. You can have it for saving my life. You really You're not real. You're dead. Oh, you need not remind me. Yeah! Help me! He was good. Cloud won't be joining us after all. No need to assume the worst. I'm sure he's fine. You saw him in action, didn't you? Guy's a soldier. Goddamn one-man army. First class. Hmm. You think he's a keeper? Is that a double entendre? <laughs> oh my god. For a minute. Huh? Huh? Uh, what the hell you been up to, huh? <laughs> Giving public security the runaround. That's what. Had to draw them away from the station somehow. Nicely done. Well, can't argue with results, huh? <clears throat> what? <sighs> <laughs> He's got a point. Wait. Got a question for you all. What? Ever been attacked by an invisible enemy? Uh, what? Uh, wearing robes. Came and went like the wind. <laughs> Thought they were invisible. They were, at first. Only saw them after she grabbed me. A new Shinra weapon, maybe? <laughs> More like a panic-induced hallucination. <clears throat> Never mind. Yeah. Forget I said anything. Suit yourself. Come on, let's move up. I like how nobody questioned him about who she is. A lot of people here. And in the freight car, too. Because of the evacuation order, maybe? Lucky us. We've Center got a crowd to hide here. Head for the Center front of the train and hold there. Due to an explosion at Mako Reactor 1, an emergency schedule is now in effect. Your understanding and cooperation is appreciated. The highway collapsed right in front of me. I just wanted to be Are you so right now? Oh, oh, never mind. Sorry to disturb you. Yeah, that's what I thought. Sorry, I, I didn't mean to bump the you instead. Uh huh. Right there, it was, it's a train. Hey, got a sec. Get a pen. Got out of bed this morning. So just called in sick. Just leave me alone, all right? You're uh, holding up pretty well, huh? Why don't you learn Even to take Even after what we buddy. saw at the station and all over Sector Eight, I'm a soldier. Well, my hands are still shaking. You get used to it. Why don't you it. learn to take a hit, Something buddy. to look forward to, or maybe not. Have they caught the perpetrators yet? Why don't you learn to take a hint, buddy? Uh, bitch, I'm minding my business. I wanted the truth. Oh, so so to talk to you. Got it. Man, everyone's on edge. Of course they are. Hey, Cloud. Oh, should have gone to Sector Three um, instead. If you're about to unburden yourself, don't. Yeesh. You don't make it easy. Are Stop you the one who grabbed my sleeves? Should have gone to Sector 3 instead. Why don't you learn to take a hint, buddy? I can't stop thinking about it. 
The bomb I made shouldn't have produced an explosion that big. It doesn't make any sense. The explosion triggered a reaction with the Mako. You said so yourself. That was my first guess, but shouldn't the reactor have fail-safes to prevent that kind of thing? Hmm. You mentioned invisible enemies back there, right? Right. <sighs> no. I'm just looking for excuses for something that was clearly my own fault. <sighs> Gotta own up to it if I'm gonna learn from this and move on. Thanks, Cloud. You're a good listener. I can't believe I survived that. I was ready to die. What the hell? Like it wasn't your fault. I doubt this will be the There's last insurance game. Yeah. What kind of maniacs would go so far as to bomb a reactor? <sighs> They've yet to announce it publicly, but I heard it was Avalanche's doing. Really? Aren't they the terrorists who tried to kill the president? Is there nothing they won't do? Hey, <gasps> quit talking <gasps> out your ass. <gasps> Everyone knows Avalanche only cares about saving the planet. Hmm? Just, just who do you think you are? A law-abiding concerned citizen. Law-abiding? Really? What does that mean? <laughs> uh, shh. What you trying to say? In my humble opinion, that explosion was a message. A message to the bastards bleeding our planet dry. Think they got it? Heard it loud and clear? Y'all's masters? We will not submit to intimidation or violence, but work together for peace and prosperity. That is how civilized people change the world! That's right! That is the Shinra Creed. <laughs> Them spiking words. It's what we believe. We all have to follow our conscience, don't we? Bro, you're making yourself go. super obvious. Right. Just let it go, yo. Everybody's not gonna agree with your message. Let's get this out of the way. Personally, I find visual aids make the dull stuff a lot more bearable. If it helps, think of it as an initiation rite. How many times do I have to tell you people? I'm not... There's such a thing as playing too hard to get. So, here we've got a wireframe model you of the great city of Midgar, complete with lips. massive steel plates suspended 300 meters above ground level. Atop which stands a shining beacon of civilization. The whole system is sustained by the Mako reactors, which feed the insatiable appetites of the public. The train will be passing through an ID uh. checkpoint shortly. This here is the train's route. As you can see, it'll take us around this main pillar. Look, we're about halfway through it now. They've set up a checkpoint here to scan the IDs of all passengers heading in and out. Date of birth, residential status, criminal history, all that and more is automatically cross-referenced in their databases. Public security wouldn't have it any other way. Heads up. Don't worry, our IDs are impeccable. What'd I tell ya? Have a little faith. Won't be long till we reach the bottom. Relax. Take a good look. It's because of that great big pizza in the sky that people down there gotta struggle to survive. 
Shinra sucks up Mako. While the soil turns to dust, the air fills with smog, and the flowers die. Then leave and don't look back. <sighs> that's what's always worked for me. <sighs> well, that's all well and good. If you're only out for yourself. But the folks down there don't have the luxury of choice, you know? I, I get you. They can't make it out the hood. Like this train, I suppose. There's only one way it can go. One, members lost zero. And one step closer to a brighter future. Hell yeah! Guys! Lower your voices, huh? People are listening. Oh, uh, right. Uh, I mean, you're the loudest one. Now get some on, uh. You've earned it. Just be ready for the next mission, all right? Hmm. I mean, granted, <laughs> you weren't talking about bombs that day, but still. <laughs> See you soon. Uh, at Seventh Heaven. You know where Tifa works. Don't keep her waiting. She'll worry. You talking to me or the character? Not long now. Are you sure you haven't? How are people life? here taking the news? It's got a lot of them worried, but not enough to stop them from partying, I guess. You see the huge explosion on TV? Hmm? How about it, baby girl? Hmm? Train services have concluded for the day. We will provide an update on the schedule first thing tomorrow morning. Thank you for your patience. Emergency train services have now concluded. This was the final train of the day. We apologize for the inconvenience, but please have a safe journey home. All right. Well, then you can fall in love with Fried Ooh, Marsh all over again. How much is enough Fried Marsh? A handful, or hear me out, a whole heap? Hey. I wish oh. I could tell you, but sadly, I don't have a passion for processed food. You mentioned the place by the washing machine. I need something so stiff it knocks me out. They had this hmm? one drink in Wall Market. Tasted like the nectar of the gods. <laughs> we ain't got shit like that here. How about one that tastes like You get like a cherry this? Coke. Service here. Sucks. Some OT when it happened. Wanna know what I was thinking the whole time I was evacuating? So the Mako one slum slider with extra black milli case. How about some soup with that? Some warm bowl of soup is too. What about uh sounds great? Get a burrito bowl with some mild and medium salsa. Some guys on the train were saying stuff about Shinra, criticizing the good work we do. Ingrates, I hope you were able to talk some sense into them. Yeah, of course. They were blubbering like babies by the time I was through with them. Well done, dear. You know what? I'm gonna let you have that. Some guys on the train were saying stuff about Shinra. Criticizing the good work we do. Ingrates, I hope you were able to talk some sense into them. Yeah, of course. They were blubbering like babies by the time I was. When I put him in charge of my stand, I told him. Right, some guys on the train were saying stuff like shit. I think he's over by the TVs. Mm -hmm. What kind of person bombs a reactor? What kind of person goes That's what I heard. Of. Sounds familiar. 
Dumb Platys only had it so good because of the reactors. And this bombing's changed all that. I'd never seen anything like it before. It was completely uh. insane. Security was out full force. There are people too, you know. I even saw a few helicopters. Wow, that sounds intense. <laughs> uh, it was like a giant candle lighting up the whole sky. Uh, Sector 8 was a nightmare. Fires everywhere. Oh, really? I mean, so I hear. Huh. Mako is the lifeblood of the planet? Yeah, the hell it is. Goddamn eco warriors with their dumbass posters. I tear them down and they're back up inside of an hour. Like I've got nothing better to do. I mean, look at all that steelwork. You trying to tell me that's not progress? <laughs> <laughs> What the? You okay, buddy? <laughs> Mako junkie, huh? Four sayers. You again. But it didn't bother you this time, so. That hot shower can't come soon enough. I can barely tell my skin from all the ash and sweat. When I get back, it's refueling time. And you, Jesse? I don't know. Figure out how I screwed up? <laughs> You're such a kidder. What was this back here? Um, excuse me? Due to an emergency, entry into this area is prohibited. Sorry for the inconvenience. You call that a warning? No, sir! In accordance with emergency regulations, entry into this area is prohibited. Please, leave at once. Still too nice! I thought that was very professional. This area is off limits. Turn around and leave at once. If you don't, I'll have no choice but to use force. Now you're getting the hang of it. At a biatch, and you got it. Um. All jokes aside, dude. Um, this this guy's gonna get you killed. Be professional. You don't want to mess with the monsters in here. Move along now. Wait. Is that Joe Swanson? Warning. Gate broken. Fiends in area. Exercise caution. No reason to check it out. Not my problem. And just where do you think you're going, huh? That is him. Patrick Warburton. AKA Joe Swanson. See, something happened with the Mako reactor and the explosion. There's materia everywhere. What the fuck is that guy doing? No, oh, dancing. Well, we did. In conjunction with President Shinra, has declared a state of emergency in Midgar. The administration has issued assurances that that's where I work. No freaking way! Put that fire out, idiots! I was there yesterday. For the attack, but security services are working tirelessly to identify those involved. If you have any information pertaining to the identity of the perpetrators. Are they going to turn the reactor off? Why did people blow it up? Are they going to turn it off? 
Hey, you got a choice. Blew up. Remember the last time I saw a real one? <laughs> oh. Huh? Thought it was uh, <sighs> jealousy. <laughs> How sweet. When did you get so thoughtful? A guy can change. Has been five years. Huh? I need to talk to Barrett. Right. Come on in. Daddy, the Mako place blew up. Everyone on TV is talking about it. Don't you worry about all that silliness. Daddy's here and he's not going anywhere tonight. Now turn that thing off and let's get you to bed, huh? Huh? Yeah, yeah, your money. Ask Tifa. She takes care of all that. Uh... <laughs> think you're doing scaring my daughter like that daddy says never talk to strangers <laughs> that's right honey i do say that what a good girl you are remembering daddy's lessons <laughs> you know what else good girls do they go to bed on time come on but i'm not tired i want to talk some more daddy mm, all right but just this once <sighs> Uh, so then, what can I get you? My money. I'm still waiting on it. Uh, right. About that. We should talk outside. <sighs> uh, first indicator is some um, bullshit. Daddy, did the people who died all return to the planet? Of course. Before we get on to money, there's an empty apartment in a place just down the road. It's nothing fancy, but I was thinking you could stay there for now. The landlady's a big friend of the cause, so you wouldn't even have to pay rent. Sound good? Sure does. Thanks. <laughs> Follow me then. The cause? How was it up on the plate? It was chaotic. When Sorry for dragging you into all this. It was wrong of me to put you in crazy. danger like that. I, I promise that I won't do it again. Dangerous part of the job. Don't worry about me. <laughs> I'll try not to. Always happy to help stick it to Shinra. Not good at all. So, you make nice with everyone? Much as I could, all things considered. Maybe not enough for them. Good. You had me worried. You're not exactly a people person. I'll give you that. I saw Sector 8 on the news. It was like a war zone. The news is just another Shinra mouthpiece. We'll spread whatever lies Shinra tells them to. to, happen to so, us. How it, it wasn't that bad? It was. Oh, right. And here we are. Good old Stargazer Heights. You're on the second floor. Stargazer Heights. Yep, sounds like the hood. Room 201 here is where I sleep. Don't have time for much else, what with 7th Heaven and all. <laughs> Not even time to decorate. Here's your room, 202. 
Don't worry. I already told the landlady about you. You did? Yes? Oh, I mean, I told her I had a friend looking for a place to stay. Was that too much? No. It's fine. And this? That one's, uh... Know what? It's getting late. I'll introduce you tomorrow. You could probably tell me... Hey, that's just a friend. You don't have to make it sound like an obvious excuse. It's a little bare, but should be enough to get you through the night. If you want anything else, we can always there get it. There is one thing. My money. You guys owe me 2,000, remember? I do. And we'd love to settle up, especially Jeez. since this was your first job for us, but... That's it? Sorry. We spent the rest preparing for the mission. That really is it. But not for long. I'm collecting money for filters tomorrow, so I can pay you after. <sighs> and you're sure about that? Of course, as long as you help, that is. Wait, then I'd have to pay you for that, too. Never mind. No, two thousand's enough. That's what we agreed on, so that'll be the price. With what you gave me, that leaves fifteen hundred. You're the best. I'll see you bright and early at the bar, then. Thanks again for everything. Sleep tight. It's time for introductions. No, it's time to mind your business. Moaning and groaning. But he's not a bad guy. The landlady asked me to check on him now and then to make sure he's okay. Can I ask you to do the same? Sure. You know, I just almost murdered that dude, right? <laughs> this is why you should warn people of people that may make strange noises in the middle of the night. Cloud? No shower? Alright, y'all. So, I'm gonna wrap it up there. 
had a bit of a wild night, hallucinations and such, uh, PTSD, childhood trauma, all that stuff, so, yeah, but it's a new day now, so, let's go help Tifa with some odd jobs, and we'll see, in any case, my name's Advance, thanks for tuning in, I'll catch y'all on the next one.